What's up guys, Red X Tech here, and in this video I'll be showing you how to take the Monster Get Visualizer and putting it into a video file so that you can overlay it on one of your song videos if you have any of those. So yeah, the first thing you're going to want to do is, if you haven't already, look at my last video which shows you how to get this onto your desktop. And the next thing is you're going to want to install a software called OBS, or Open Broadcast Software. Just go and download that. It's obsproject.org, I think. So yeah, you're gonna wanna, um, yeah, just go set that up. Watch a t tutorial on that. So yeah, open up your rain meter, and you should have this already loaded up. Then Let's show you that's working. Yep, yeah, right there. So um. Yeah, what you're going to want to do is come into OBS, make a new scene, name it whatever you want, I'm going to call it Visualizer for now, create a new source, display capture, and name it whatever, this is short for Visualizer, make sure make source visible is checked, that should be automatically checked. I'm going to turn off capture cursor because there's no need for it to be in here. Click on OK. Right click on your new source, click on filters, click on add filter, color key, name it whatever you want, I'll leave it as color key, type, custom color, select color, and black. Okay, so now you have the color key set up. What we're going to want to do is just look up back, around, oops, background settings, and change your picture or your background to a solid color. I have mine set black, so that's how it'll work here. Now you'll see that it cuts out everything that's black, so it'll have it transparent. Now I'll create a new filter and call it crop or make it crop. Now I'm gonna have to make these. Um, crop it relative to your screen size and where you place the monster cat things. And yeah, just pretty hard to get it right on. So I'm going to have to look at my previously set up one and look at the crop on this. 325, okay. So yeah, just crop it to your screen and then that will be how it'll work for you. It, it'll always depend on your screen size and what it is, but crop it so that it's just outlining this, or however you have it. So yeah, you can close that now, and um, make this bigger, or smaller. I, I, I'd, I would fill up the screen with it. And just like move it to the middle or wherever. So yeah, now what you're going to want to do is just make OBS smaller, move it to a different monitor, or do whatever, but bring it below here, so that you cannot see it in there, and then when you, you can set it to a hotkey by, to start recording, you can either click on this, or go into settings, hotkeys, and then start and stop recording, have it set to number pad zero. So you're going to drag it down here. And I'm going to press my start recording button. So now it's started recording. Now we're going to start playing. Just let this go for a while. Make sure that your microphone audio is turned off so that you won't have any mic audio in your video. Okay, that's good enough. Um, now we can go into the place where we keep our OBS recordings. Wait, it's the 27th today, right? So, so yeah, this one was yesterday. So now you'll have this video file. And, um, yeah, that, there you have it. You can, um, take this file and overlay it on one of your videos and it should be great. Make sure to trim it so that it fits with the sound though, because the sound might be odd sometimes. 
Well, yeah, I'm going to change my background back because I do not need it normally. I'm just going to keep it a picture for now because that is how I prefer it. But you can do whatever. So yeah, that is the end of my tutorial on the Monster Cat Visualizer. If you enjoyed, then subscribe for more tutorials. See you guys later. Bye!